What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'll talk about the BenQ screen bar once again. I made a video on this about uh, two months ago now. It was December the 14th, so it's been a while. And in that video, I kind of did an unboxing review, talked about exactly what the screen bar kind of offered. And of course, if you guys want to check out a screen bar, I will have the Amazon link and the BenQ link down in the description below, along with BenQ's Twitter, if you would like to check them out on Twitter. But uh, the BenQ lighting product, I was not really skeptical about, but I wasn't really sure if it was going to be something that would honestly help me out, you know, kind of in the end, you know, would it be something that I would actually uh, really like, something that I'd actually really use day in and day out. And I will say it is definitely something that I have used day in and day out and would not trade for anything. I know that's going to sound kind of crazy, but as you guys kind of can see the example here in the background image that I have, it kind of shows you that it lights up your whole desk area, which is nice. So when I'm working on YouTube videos, I have a lot of light here. I like to use the different types of uh, you know settings they have for cooler temperatures, that kind of thing. I have the kind of yellow type light on usually like right now when I'm working on a video, if I'm editing, doing that kind of thing. Whenever I'm playing, I turn it on to the brighter setting. And of course, it kind of auto sets to the room you're in, depending on how much light is available in the room. And it really does seem to help when I'm gaming to not give me that eye strain, to not give me headaches. And the odd thing before BenQ had even contacted me about this, I had purchased a set of uh, gaming glasses about a year ago that were supposed to be blue tint style glasses glasses that would help out you know for headaches eye strain that kind of thing and they worked fairly well but i'm not a big fan i don't wear glasses normally i'm not a person that has you know eye issues so i don't wear glasses so they're not comfortable on my face it, just for me I'm, I'm just not a big fan of them and they worked okay i still would get headaches from time to time uh, so I'm not sure if it was just, you know, maybe I didn't have a dark enough tint when it came to the style of glasses. You know, they have different types of tint that you can purchase when it comes to those, you know, blue tint kind of screen glasses that you can buy. But when BenQ sent me this product, I wasn't really skeptical. But of course, you know, I'm not going to knock anything until I try it. So I wanted to make sure this was a really good product, uh, you know, before I, I came, kind of came out and told you guys that it is definitely worth the purchase. And I will say it is definitely worth the purchase. It, it is something that... I don't think I could go without now. It is absolutely phenomenal how much of a difference that is made uh, compared to, you know, anything else that I've ever had to kind of help with eye strain. So if you're a person that likes to work from home, uh, you know, if you're a person that does work from home, if you do a lot of work on the computer, if you like to play games, whatever the case may be, I would highly recommend checking one of these out. And as you guys can see, I'm going to move my camera, so I'm probably never going to get this set back right. But you can kind of see that it's still um, sitting here on my, if you can see this a uh, little bit now. There we go. You can, you can still see that it's sitting here on top of my uh, monitor and it is on 24 seven. So I, I'm using this thing all the time. So I'm never at a time where this is not turned on. So if I'm doing work, like I said, on YouTube, I just kind of have it set on to the, you know, the, the, uh, the different type, type of light setting. So it may be a little bit, you know, kind of that yellow tint. If I'm gaming, I'll let it, you know, go to that kind of brighter, wider tint. And it really does help with that screen glare. It really does help with everything that is available uh, or everything that I've tried that's available out there really does help compared to those other products. And I've tried several different things. Like I said, I've tried the glasses, a uh, several different pair and I've just not been a big fan of them. So when, like I said, when BenQ reached out to me, I was definitely interested in this product because as a person that sits here and, you know, edits and, and works on YouTube videos and gets footage and some days sits here for 10, 11, 12 hours, which is kind of ridiculous at times if you think about it, but sometimes it takes that long to do some of the stuff that I do, of course, for YouTube. This really does help out. So I would highly recommend, if, like I said, if you work from home, if you're a gamer, if you spend a lot of time on a computer, definitely try one of these out. Anyway, guys, leave me your thoughts if you gave these, uh, you know, these screen bars a look. If you have not, like I said, everything will be linked down in the description below. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.